The name of the game is hope, and finding it in whatever form it presented itself. As usual, it's always the last place you look. This is starting to become real. Yeah. Do you want to put something like, is there jelly bean in there still or top shelf? Uh, there's top, yeah, there's top shelf. Okay, yeah, so can you just add this to the pile and we'll like okay. do a single line now? Yeah. That's organized. Raffle. Okay. Free stuff. There you be. What's in here? Um, What's making this so crazy today? Uh, what's it so crazy? Well, free comic books that usually brings out like everyone. And then, uh, yeah, no, we're doing like a huge sale. We've got a raffle going on right now, and we'll have a costume contest later. And yeah, it's just it's a it's an opportunity for all the geeks to come out of the woodwork and say hi to each other. So yeah. This is like a lot of people. It's generally the most people we get all year. So uh, it's really super duper exciting. So passionate about it though, as busy as you want. Oh yeah, no, of course, because again, comic books, right? So yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, everything should be in graphic novel format. Why not? Really, it should be the best thing ever. He's actually Iron Man, don't tell anyone. Yeah. Yeah. Keep that on a DL. Don't let Hydra know. The reason we're drawn to the things we're drawn to is because they have elements in them that we connect with. Um, they are stories that, despite the fantastic trappings, have things that, that emotionally make sense to us. There's one line, or there's like something that the superhero does where you like want to punch this guy and be like, hell yeah, you know? Yeah. It has been one thing that has really kept me going. Like when I was feeling like six feet under the ground, or when I was feeling high as the clouds, was that there were still comic books. That was something that was there for me. <laughs> I think that a picture tells, uh, was it? A picture says a thousand words. It's pictures and words, and it's some of the most moving stories and the most heroic people and iconic figures you'll ever find. And so, like, I mean, comic books endure. Just dealing with feeling like nobody understands you or things like that, that's what a lot of superheroes deal with in their own lives. The important part is watching people make those choices to be heroic over and over again because that tells you that you can do the same thing. I think that every one of us has at one time or another been bullied. And I think that... I'll... DC, I feel like, is super duper, like, truly unique in terms of having such a diverse community of people who are into comic books and then, like, you know, not afraid to say that they are geeks, you know? Is that Klingon? Yes. Speaking of Klingon to me? Yes, I'm saying Klingon. La comic poo, maj la kak jajiva. Raffles? Okay. Everyone so up. everyone, we're starting the raffle now, which is going to consist of us sticking our fingers into the cup and pulling out a name. And then you get a prize. So, okay. Renzi King? What? Hey. Really? <laughs> Renzi, you just won yourself a free copy of the Court of